party in his essence is quite black and white. You don't have one male sound. You being morally right or you being morally in not right. There is no middle way in it. What I mean is there is not such thing as kind and ethical can uh, carnism, meat eating, flesh eating, corpse eating, how you want to call it. There is not such thing as that. Just like there is not a kind way to murder humans, there is not a kind way to murder animals. They don't want to be harmed. Just like you don't want to be harmed. Just like I don't want to be harmed for no good reason. Traditions, beliefs and habits, the three main factors of carnism and of meat eating be not justifiable because the majority wants to support them. Let me go to Waller's traditions that uh, one times the majority find a good finds goods to have. Slavery Nazism Nazism Yeah Slavery has also three main factors Traditions, beliefs and habits Carnism, traditions, beliefs and habits Nazism, beliefs, habits All forms of injustice have in main have in essence always the same kind of essence so what was uh, sexism sexism are also traditional three factors traditions because society is built by man and the rules being made up by man and protect man's interest in the first place because men have created them and most men be not so put in watching things from another perception also some women that so it is not an absolute an absolute night and ends an absolute point of form Standpoint that not can be challenged with logical, with logic. Just like was also true, habits of the end time, because most of the people do it. So, and it was also beliefs, because so all all victimizers. I've done around whole history. No matter if you watch it from the position of uh, petty criminals or high mass murderers or political criminals or how you want to call them. Around whole history, they are only watch the situation of the position of themselves, the position of the victimizer. But this is why it be. If you watch things only from of your position and not watch it from the position of somebody else, it becomes pretty easy to make excuses for many atrocious acts. 
from mass murder to rape to execution, from child slave of labor, from uh, pedophilia to um, racial discrimination, from speciesism to white supremacism, etc., etc., etc. But when you win the victim, things look a lot different from that angle. Have you ever tried it? Sometimes. Not always. The nasty people, the pricks, turned out to be true. Traditions with all his evils and all his goods. Be not always one uh, good sign of uh, moral combat. That's what traditions mean in its essence. In most cases, traditions be just confirmed excuses. If you don't look positions from another perception. Traditions being in its essence nothing more than one excuse to let the status quo just like it be and not look to yourself. That majority believe something, don't make it an absolute. That is obvious. The majority of the slave masters were wrong. Just like the majority of the white supremacists, just like the majority of the Nazi-Zionist uh, men in the time uh, before the Civil War, was wrong. Just like the people that been against veganism, against animal rights, that mean that you've been against moral justice and up against compassion and decency proof how deep in oppressional thoughts most humans be vegans only ask you to stop harming the animals how have nothing harmed harm you intentional once in their whole life. The least you can do is become vegan. What's the excuse for causing the least amount of harm possible on the planet? Always being vegan.